Okay, question number three is a mixing problem. And we have a formula in our book which says that dq dt equals um, concentration in times volume in minus q t on top of l where we have the same rate going in and the same rate going out which is the situation in this case so it's full and has 20 kilograms of the powder in 100 liters of water therefore in the container at the start the liters is 100 and q is 20 then we have a concentration fresh water is going in so my concentration in is zero and the volume going in is two liters per minute and it's run off at the same rate so the volume out is two so dq dt is zero minus 2q on 100 which is negative q on 50. and to solve that i'm just going to use d solve so my q against t that's my y against x therefore i've got um y dash so y dash equals negative y divided by 50 and i will go interactive calculate d solve where my independent variable is x my dependent variable is y and my initial condition is that when x equals zero i've got 20 kilograms of powder and i go okay and there is my general rule that q equals 20 e to the minus t on 50 which is that rule there find the amount of powder after 10 minutes sub in 10 and you'll end up with 16.4 um, how long does it take for the nearest second for the concentration to become this well if the concentration is 0 0.075 kilograms per liter and there's 100 liters therefore that's the same as having 7.5 kilograms of powder so make q equal to 7.5 solve for t you get 49 minutes that's how that question operates